Hi, good morning or good evening everyone. Welcome back to the Resolution Technologies. Yes, in this video, the which you would like to discuss about. So once you have enrolled, that means registered to the Ryzen Shine, as the payment is done for the course. Yes, how you can start the courses? And what are the like regular labs to practice it and assignments? Yes, where you can find it, those labs and assignments. And what are the class PPTs which we are going to use it? Yes, that's PPTs where you can find it. And as well as how you can access the daily class videos. So these are all the four points that which you would like to show that from the Ryzen Shen portal. Yeah, how you can access the regular classes and regular, I mean, there's a previous recorded, yes, the course videos for about your references and the labs, assignments and the PPTs. Yes, where you can find it. That is the main object of this uh, video. Let me show that in the Ryzen portal. So once you have created the account, you can just log in with that, the email ID. Already if you have those like uh, the doubt, I mean, um, if you don't know that account creation, so I have given that like in another video, how you can create an account, which you can refer it in our YouTube channel. Yeah, once you sign into that, the portal, so you can go to that about your dashboard. Yeah, once you enroll to the course, that is a payment is done, we will add you to that one of the group. So which batch you are belong to that or which batch you are joining uh, to that uh, group we will assign to you. So here you can see that um, in the left side menu in our dashboard, you can find it groups. Yes, which group you, you are belong to that. That's a group you can find it. But here uh, for the testing point of view, we have given that some DevOps uh, the group but the which batch you are belong to that so the batch number based we will you will find it the group name here so in this group that like we are going to assign this the courses one by one on the base of the course is going on we don't give that all the courses at the same time so on the base of like a course which is going on in the linux or um, then like shell then aws then the DevOps tools, Docker, Kubernetes, mounting tools, Azure. So on the base of the course modules, we will uh, allocate that uh, the courses to here. Uh, but initially, whenever you uh, enroll into that, you will be having so one course. So that is about uh, DevOps with Cloud Engineer. But how you can access the courses is, yes, you can access from here as well. Eh? But list of all the courses that which you can uh, access Yeah, from here, uh, already I was showing this in the previous video yeah, about classes, I mean the courses, how you can access it. But yes, initially we'll be having that uh, DevOps and the cloud demo videos. Yes, this is the course. But you need to, if you, I mean, it is not showing that the course DevOps with um, um, the cloud engineer course, then what you need to do this is, you need to go to the, the groups. And here you can see this, accessing the course. Normally, we will share it uh, whenever we add the course to you. We will share that course link in the WhatsApp group. Directly, you can access this course from there itself, this course link. But yes, you can go back to that about your group. And in the group also, you can find it, the courses which are allocating to you. Yeah, so this is the course. But initially, which is uh, showing the status as a start course. Until that start the course, you cannot access. You see that? Here uh, it is disabled. So any course which we are assigning to you is nothing but directly you cannot access it until you start the course. Yes, first start the course, which course you are going to um, use it, start the course. Yeah, now in this course, we have given that Yes, like uh, what are what are all the course modules which are going to present it? That is about Linux and shell scripting. 
AWS, DevOps tools, Docker and Kubernetes, Python, monitoring tools, Azure. Yeah, what are the modules that have been included in our course? One by one, you can access it on the basis of the course is going on. But in each module section, what you can access it? Yes, yeah, suppose uh, if I show this in the Linux and the shell scripting this course. So if you click on that, that Linux and shell scripting related the courses. And here you can find it exercises and exercises and the lab guides. And you can find that the projects and the workshops of this Linux and shell script. PPTs and any the supported materials if you share it is yes, the PPTs and materials and finally the forums. The yeah, forum is another interesting concept. I'll come back. Uh, this is very, very important. I will share it in the another video about the forum, how you can use it. Uh, but yes, if you would like to uh, refer that Linux and Shell script courses, yes, yes, if you click on this, the courses section, now you can see that the courses, essential courses and advanced courses. But by default, you cannot access it, these courses, until we give the permission. But what about what is the difference between the regular uh, class videos and as well as um, uh, these uh, I mean the pre-recorded essential uh, courses if you just uh, understand it a regular class videos that's about your class section in the class whatever it was discussed that you will be having but here so before coming to the class and if you would like to refer it and come to the classes Yes, the best approach is whenever you are learning before coming to the class. Yes, that's um, um, the pre-recorded. I mean, already the the previous uh, batches related the videos we are sharing about it. So just go ahead one time and review about it and come back to the class. Then what you are going? To, what is the benefit of that one? Is one time you are hearing here, one time you are watching this. And the same class and the same content, once again, you are going to uh, yes, getting about that in the classes. Then what is the advantage is you will be having that any doubts or any kind of uh, yes, like uh, a cl clarifications which are required. Then you can uh, discuss in the class. Yeah, my recommendations that is so whenever we uh, whenever you are going to join to the class. Yes, that's a section related or at least a class is over. Okay, in the class, same video, whenever you are going through that, you will get that some, uh, the same concept. But yes, what's a, what it was discussed, just you can, uh, if you'd like to refer it, you can refer from this course as well as. But by default, this is showing this as a private course. Private course is nothing but it is not assigned to you. So once we assign it, then it shows that the start the course and you can use the start course and you can continue about it. Or if you're not able to access this course, yes, please ping in that the WhatsApp group. Then we will help you on that. Yes, so on which content now it is going on, which courses you are requesting, we will check it and we will give the permissions. But suppose when all the Linux is going on and if you ask the permissions about the AWS, until there is a specific reason we don't assign it but you have the, some emergency and some kind of uh, learning fast then okay uh, in there some such situations we will allow it given the permissions but in the normal cases we don't give it yeah so here you can find that list of all the courses of the section but i will come back uh, the clearly on the linux courses uh, devops courses projects the one by one on that each section i will come back but overall if you go to that suppose so what is the course we are talking that so whenever you uh, enroll it yes this is the course which will be assigned devops with the cloud engineer and here you can uh, start the, the first module the course modules which will be redirected to that this course modules page so which course you would like to learn it or which labs you are planning to access it. Then you can go to the, the particular section, then particular module in that module. If you need the courses to refer it, 
or if you'd like to refer the exercises and lab guides or if you'd like to refer to the projects and workshops ppts or the materials on the forums you can access it from here like that if you go to the each module whether that is um, the devops or uh, aws so the same structure which we have given that suppose so uh, i see the aws related yes if you'd like to know that aws courses to access about it yes you can go to the aws and aws related all the courses Yeah, essential course and cloud formation, Python with the Boto three exercises, Lambda serverless architecture. Uh, that AWS related essential courses and advanced courses which you can find it like that exercises and lab guides. Yes, there are the like uh, lab guides. Uh, how you can access the lab guides? I will give the separate another section. Forums related, I will give the separate and exercises and lab guides to access it. I will give that uh, separately and projects and workshops. Yes, the projects. As yes, here, AWS point of view, real time project one and real time project two, you have, and as well as on that AWS with the Terraform one project we have. Yeah, there are all the projects uh, which you can uh, refer it, and one workshop which we need to perform it on the code commit, code deploy, code pipeline. So, like this, it has been organized. So, that's uh, the entire uh, uh, the course sections that which you can easily browse it. And if you have any issues or any queries, then you can ping this in the WhatsApp group respecting that particular batch which you have belong to that yeah that's about how you can find it list of all the modules and that modules to access about it that module related specific courses or the specific uh, uh, the exercises yeah so let me go back to the course Yeah, from here you can access the all the modules. Yes, yeah, suppose Docker and Kubernetes. Yes, Docker and Kubernetes related the courses, exercises, and lab guides of this uh, Docker. Yeah, Docker related exercises and these are all the lab guides which you can find it here. Docker file labs, Docker compose exercises, DevOps assignment on say with the Docker. And Kubernetes related projects and the workshops. Yeah, the Docker with the Node.js, PPTs of that, whatever we present about the Docker and the Kubernetes related. As you can find it, the resources. So this is the basic course which we will allocate to you. Yeah, but how you can access these courses? You can go back to that about your um, the group section. Let's go to the dashboard, or you can directly go to the, the group section. Normally, we will share it uh, in the WhatsApp group about that the direct course links once the course has been assigned to you. Or you can go to that about your group. Yeah, this is about your group. In this group, you can find it about the courses which have been assigned to you. And from here, you can access the courses first time. But once it has been started, the course, now it is showing the continue course. That means you have already started. Um, then you can go to the about your courses section and list of all the courses which you are uh, going through that you can find it all the courses yeah now so this is the course just which we discussed from the next time onwards like first time starting time you need to start the course so then you can directly ask about your courses or the groups and i will give that what is the learning paths and uh, that is another video uh, how you can access the learning paths Yes, refer that one time at least to get the familiarity with the horizon portal that would be helpful yeah so devops and cloud um yeah the demo videos are the cloud engineer and once you enroll that course start the course then that course which will be listed here itself but until that the course start it won't be listed uh, but uh, the courses where you will be having this is you need to that the group and in the group section you can find it that yeah this is one section as uh, i thought it took you that the information about how you can access the courses and the second one is second point what is that 
yeah so this is also which we were understanding right where you can find the labs and assignments yes go to the, the particular linux module in that linux linux related labs and assignments or if you are working with that like aws aws go to that aws module and aws related labs and assignments you can find it over there and as well as the class ppts yes these three section that is uh, categorized as a module if you go to the particular module the initial course which you can accept but how you can access that daily class videos daily class videos so that is a separate course we give it because that's uh, the first these are all the things for all the batches that is a generic for all the batches that is the generic but specific to that about your batch regular class videos to access it we create a separate course and that course which will be assigned to you so we will share it about that video suppose let me uh, just assign uh, to this uh, user like which are using that to for to testing i will share it like one uh, batch uh, let me actually that batch specific course which will be added to that group uh, but for the testing point of view, I'm going to add it one of the batch to this user, the batch regular videos. To get to familiar with that, how you can access the regular class videos. Suppose here we have the something batch, uh, the 46. Or four, I'm going to assign to this user batch 46. So which batch you are belong to that, that batch specific course you can find it. So now let's go back to the about our browser I have just assigned in the group background. Now, uh, if you just go back and if you see this uh, courses, is it listing here? Yeah, see this is still didn't get it the courses for here but let's go back to that group section if you go first time you need to start it so if you go to that about your group and in this group you see this like a one batch related course has been assigned so now first time what you need to do that so click on the course From the group normally we will share it to these links in the whatsapp group regularly on the basis of that the uh, the activities yes now the once you uh, access this course the first time you need to start the course yes if you start the course then in this course you will be having that daily class videos yeah that is a demos of that about your batch and then uh, the regular linux class videos the shell script then aws all that's that's we added like these sections the demo videos then the linux then shell aws and you will be having that the question and answers of the online exam also yes what are like the sunday uh, the exams which we are going to conduct it that exam related the question and answers we will share it in this section itself we will add it one section online exam question and answers and you can find it the question and answers from this course itself this is specific to about your batch so one time if you start this course then next time you don't need to go to that each and every time group section you can access from the group about your group or you can directly go to the courses section now you can see that course in your course list so devops with the cloud batch specific to that and this is about your um, entire uh, course all the modules you can access it this is the generic course and this is initial that's the demo videos which have been given that so like this so you can use it rns portal to access about generic all the modules related courses labs exercises projects ppts forums but i will share it 
the separate separate videos for each one to get more familiarity yeah this is the like uh, the generic course devops with cloud engineer and specific to that about your batch yes this uh, that with that batch number you will be having that course i hope so you understand now how you can access about your courses the labs exercises and as well as the regular class videos so if you have this um, still any queries questions so that's i mean actually this video we are uh, going to post it in our channel subscribe to the channel to get that all the notifications in the youtube channel subscribe it then the labs also we will share it in the channel itself but main regular courses and everything that is through the portal you are going to access it so subscribe to the youtube channel also that's you will get it like a notifications whenever we add it any video or any lab information or any kind of uh, forum information so you will get that that update yeah so that's all from this section so i hope so you understand this all the points yes thank you thank you all so once about your activities one more point once about your activities are done so please log off um the properly sometimes you will get it user already logged in exceptions that means you didn't clear properly you didn't log off properly clear the cache and re-log in it sometimes we see that user already logged in if you see that message just to clear about your browser cache and re-log it yeah thank you